welcome back to my channel it's the only with thrifty divas and I'm here with another Dollar Tree haul for everybody um, if you enjoy Dollar Tree hauls and some DIYs and things of that nature don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that bell when it pops up also so you can be notified anytime I post new content um, all right so let's just jump right in as always and again it's a pick and grab um, so no particular rhyme or reason I picked up two more boxes of the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes because um, my husband liked them. And once my husband likes it, it's a problem. So I picked up two more. Then I picked up a bag of the Mosaic Veggie and Potato Chip in Sour Cream and Onion. Uh, I don't think I ever had the Sour Cream and Onion one before, but I love these things. I love them. They have organic green peas, organic yellow peas, organic potato, organic spinach, and you can like see the pieces of them in there. It's so cool. Then I really liked this and my husband really liked it. So I went to get more and they only had two more left in the store. So I got the two, the coffee. It's really, really good. I like it so much, but it does have the most sugar out of all three of them. It has like, hold on, let me tell you, 22 grams and 6 grams of protein, whereas the vanilla and the green tea have 10 grams of sugar and 7 grams of protein. So, then I got some ice cream treats. I got two of the M&M sandwich cookies, the vanilla ice cream. And they, those need to go in the freezer like immediately and I got two of the Snickers ice cream bars as well and next I picked up two boxes of the Arm & Hammer fresh and natural um, odor eliminator the one with the doors on it you know like it has that like filter on there that you pull it off for the um, freezer and fridge I got two of them then I found I was looking for these the Nature Valley three layer peanut butter and chocolate granola bars. I got seven boxes and they expire September 10th of 2019. Between me, my husband and my son, the seven boxes is not a problem. You get uh, five in every box as well. Then I picked up two bags of the Gardettos. I love this. Actually, I really just like those rye chips, <laughs> but I just, I love it. Um, and this is 8.6 ounces, so it's a good bag, good size bag. I got two of them. And if you watched my walkthrough from the other day, and I had a conversation too um, with somebody in the comments, so I did go back and get, it's so windy out here, I did go back and get the cat scarf with the glasses because I was kicking myself for not getting it. Oh my God, it's like something wicked this way comes. You guys remember that movie? I hope so. If you do, you just won 10 cool points in my book. I'm just letting you know. Um, then I picked up a can of the Manwich original, the Sloppy Joe sauce, because I have like six or seven pounds of ground turkey in my freezers right now. So I figured just another thing to do with it to use it up. I got one can of the Pinto beans, the Hanover Pinto beans. It's a, a 19 ounce can, big, big one. Then I got two of the Wishbone Chunky Blue Cheese Dressings. This is an eight ounce bottle. So I got two of those. Then I picked up two bottles of the Pedialyte. I got one in the grape and one in the orange. We have been having some hot days here lately, which is shocking. It went from like zero to a hundred real quick. What is going on? My God. <laughs> so anyway, I got them to give to my son in his sippy cup so he can stay hydrated. Job, Speaking of my son, um, I got him Good this. Job, Mama. Thank you, sweetheart. I got him this sip a mug. That's what it says. Sip a mug. Can you see it? Sip a mug. It says right there. Sip a mug. Um, and it says it's PBA free. It's Arrow Home <laughs> Products made in the USA. And it says the handle is the straw. So I got him one of those. They had, uh, I think they had, they had blue, 
red, maybe purple, um, but I just got him the green one. I thought that was nice. And in that same family, I actually went and picked up another three of these cool gear tumblers um, just to have. I'm gonna give them out as gifts and probably one for, just one for my son. Um, but he still spills stuff, you know, I don't know. But one for my son, the other two for gifts and I already bought one for a gift. Then I got these two handheld mirrors. So I got one in the white multicolored leopard print and I got one in the purple zebra. They also had a pink zebra. And I always test out in the store, I always do, before I buy something, I always test out if the sticker comes off well. Because if it doesn't, I won't even buy it. I'm not kidding. Um, Unless, and the only time I buy it is if I forgot to check. Like, can we just talk about that for a second? Those acrylic bins from Dollar Tree that I got to like do my, uh, organize my refrigerator and all that. Those, and nobody talks about this. Those are the worst labels I've ever seen in my life. My husband and I both worked on them. I got four or five of them. We soaked them for like three days. We had, we had to use like goof off. Like, I mean, it was absolutely, I talked to my aunt though. She's like, oh, I just put mine in the dishwasher and they came off. I don't know, but it was the worst label I've ever seen. I just want to say that. Anyway. Then I got this box of saltines. Now this is a full size box. You get four sleeves. So normally you just get two at Dollar Tree, but now you get four, the full size box. It's a pound. So I made sure to check. This expires November of this year. So like it's pretty good for like the fall soups, you know, like, cause that's when I like them. So, or maybe with like, I have so many crackers right now though, but saltines are like the only thing I'll put in soups for myself. So I just picked that up to make sure I have it because I don't know if I'll see it again by then. Cause you know, they sell two. It's, that's what it's always been. So what else? Uh, I got two more cans of the healthy choice chicken noodle soup for my son. Cause he loves them. I got this black and it's almost like rubberized on this side. This, it's like a combination pot holder oven mitt. I like that. So I got, I got those, I got one of those and then I got, if I can find it, the two pack of the black pot holders as well. I already have a black glove. I actually have two. They're from Williams and Sonoma. I got them as like a housewarming gift. So I just got those to go with it. Then I got this bag of halved sun-dried tomatoes. It's a hundred gram bag, uh, 3.53 ounces. I just got that to put in pastas or pasta salads. And I got three cans of the Hanover kidney beans. This is also 19 ounces and it doesn't expire until March of 2022. So I figured just to have on hand for rice and beans, for chili, for all of that stuff, I just wanna make sure I have it. I got another one of these because when I gave myself a pedicure the other day in my oil pan, if you saw the video, this, worked miracles on my heels. I am so happy with it. So I just wanted to get another one just to have. Then I picked up a blue acrylic paint to mix with a little bit of white for that um, hanging project that I'm doing out here on the rail that I showed you guys um, that I bought those wood cutouts and the wired jute cord for just to paint some of those shapes a light blue and white. Those are the two colors that I'm going to do it do with that. Then I picked up two of these. I don't even know what scent it is. It just says fresh scent. I didn't even smell it. Um, it was just the only foaming one I could find at the time. And I have a really pretty foamer in the upstairs bathroom. And my husband today told me it was empty. And he's like, I kind of don't want to throw it out. And I'm like, it needs a foam though. I know you can just like mix, 
hand soap and water, but I'm not that good at that. So I was like, I'll just find a foaming hand soap and then we'll, we'll fill it. And I made sure in the store that this did open. Um, so we're good to go. I'm just going to pour these two into my like decorative foamer that's upstairs. I picked up this gorgeous leopard print bag because if you know me by now, I am all about the animal print and I'm all about the glitter. And this is actually a really big bag. You can't tell when it's folded up, but it's actually a really, really nice size uh, makeup case. So I, and it's sassy and chic, and I'm just going to switch out the one that I have in my bathroom drawer down here now, just for a change because at a dollar you can do that. I've had the other one for like a year or so now, so I wanna look at something else every morning. So there you go. And then I think this will be my last item, guys. So manageable haul, even though it was like $56. Don't know how that happened. Okay, same brand that I hauled uh, yesterday, I think it was that Harmon Harmon home same vinyl like woven vinyl. These are square Do you see how cool these placemats are and they're like silver? They really are they're not I mean they're like gray in the middle, but they are silver. There's a sheen I could not resist. I thought these were absolutely stunning and they had a pretty aqua in this shape too. And I was like, ah, do I want to mix them? I don't know. Like I was so torn in the store. I don't know if it was up to, I might even go get like four of those to have 10. I don't know. I don't know. See, this is what happens to me, but I did get six of these cause I loved everything about it. I loved the shape and I loved the shininess. Um, so yeah. So I believe I'm just digging through to make sure I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's it. All right. There's one last thing. It's not very exciting. They have all this stuff too for a dollar and they don't expire till mid June. So I just picked up a couple of things also for me and my husband. All right. So that is it. Um, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching this haul with me. I hope you found something that you can go out and find or add to your wish list. Did I get a wish list item? I got the um, Nature Valley granola bars, honestly. I think that was the only wish list item that I got, and I did want to pick up some more of the Cool Gear cups. And from what I've seen in hauls, they got other Cool Gear stuff coming out too. So I'm hoping. I feel like my store is just not getting any of the cool stuff. I don't understand none of the seven of my stores. So I don't understand what's going on. But anyway. Um, all right. So as always, until we meet again, stay blessed, my friends. And if you haven't subscribed already, I would love to have you as a permanent part of the Thrifty Divas family. I will see you all very, very soon. Stay blessed. And I love each and every one of you. Let's take a look around Dollar Tree. They have these little hefty mini me cups. They're like little shot glasses, but they look like hefty cups. They were so cute. I've never seen those before. And then they had these finger skateboards in the brand Skate. They only had these two designs. I'm looking to see if there's more, but there's, there's not. It's just those two. The pack with the skulls and then this pack. Then they had new weird squishy monsters, but this time they have a little ball in them that lights up. I'm squeezing it to make it light, but it really lights if you just like bounce it or, or tap it on a table or something. So they had all these different colors with different faces. They're fun. Then they had these really pretty Brillo Basics wash gloves. They had the red with the white and red polka dots. Then they had the pink glove with the black and pink hearts and stuff so pretty and then the yellow with the yellow and black design down here so retro love them then they had this toucan drink cup which i haven't seen yet this season and then over here they have the sip a mugs where the handle is the straw in all these different colors you see behind me and it's not a dollar tree brand some new Main Street totes. This gorgeous one with, I believe it's a llama. 
then these butterflies and flowers back here these are all main street totes then these cactuses with look look here there's a little bunny with glasses it's so cute and then this patterned one and that's all they had those four designs and then check this out look at these notebooks where you push on it and it lights up i don't know if this is old or new um but that's the only one i saw was this butterfly one i checked here nope that was the only ones so thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed everything you saw 